Okay, welcome to my video. Today I am going to be talking about how to throw the jab correctly. Um, it might sound like the easiest punch in boxing and the first punch that you learn, because it is, okay? But that doesn't mean everyone does it right. I see a lot of mistakes when people throw the jab. I see a lot of this, dropping it. I see a lot of throwing it and then dropping it. I see a lot of this, turning the hand to the side. So today I'm just going to go over the correct way of throwing the jab. All our punches come from our stance, okay? Our stance being left hand here, right hand here. And the jab comes from here and it returns to here. Okay, so number one, we throw that jab out and we turn the hand over. We want to be hitting the wide part of our hand, turning it over. You'll find if you punch like that, you've got a, a thinner gap, a lot more chance to miss, and as well, a lot of wrist injuries come from throwing the jab there. You hit there and the wrist snaps, okay? We want to be turning it over, nice solid jab. When we throw the jab, it comes from the chin, boom, and it returns to the chin. See this shoulder here? Boom, it's protecting my chin from an overhand right here, okay? If we're throwing it from down here, boom, that chin's wide open, okay? We want a chin tucked, hands up, bang, and back. Bang, and back. And even if we miss with that jab and they slip out of the way of it, boom, with an overhand right, we're still protected. Our chin is still protected by this shoulder here. Whether you want to step into your jab and back out is up to you. You're going to get a little bit more power from stepping into it, but you might not need to step into it. You might just be flicking that jab out there just to get your range, get your distance, boom, flicking it out. Depends what you're using the jab for. The jab can be used to find your range, it can be used to set up other shots, it can be used to, uh, to score points. The jab is the most important punch in boxing, but let's make sure we're doing it right. Have a little practice, bring your hand back to your chin all the time. 